my name is Nancy Harrison, and uh, as it says up there, I'm a recent past president of the AAA. And as a longtime East Ender, I am delighted to be here uh, with my colleague this morning, uh, Appraisers Association of America Executive Director Linda Selvin. And uh, we have lots of material to cover in half an hour, so uh, I hope uh, we just, if you, anybody has any questions, that you hold them to the end. Uh, and uh, we will also be here available uh, to answer any questions you have after the talk. Uh, first, uh, I wanted to get to uh, what impacts value, because this is, these are the factors that any appraiser would have to take into account when they're preparing an, an appraiser for, appraisal for whatever purpose. Uh, and of course, the impact of the economy and socio-political factors are always going to be uh, important on who is buying out there. Uh, and as we know, as we saw from uh, the freeze of the uh, the economic turmoils of uh, the last years, uh, certainly any time there's a fear factor, uh, that can actually freeze um, uh, the, the market for what is essentially, as we know, a luxury, uh, luxury market. Uh, secondly, uh, factors from the, the art market itself. Uh, certain things like regionalism, like we're out here in Long Island and uh, there's a specific market for East End, Long Island, Hamptons art, artists who came out here. That's a regional market. There's also a California market or a Texas market, and internationally an Indian market or a Chinese market or a Canadian market. So all of those are regional markets that we have to take into account.